Hello and welcome to Cornhusker Classics from the archives of Husker Video. I'm Todd Walkenhorse. Traditionally, the Nebraska Cornhuskers had a pretty easy time with much of the Big 8 Conference. It seemed like many of the games were merely a formality en route to the end of the year showdown with the Oklahoma Sooners for the Big 8 Championship. In 1991, the Huskers traveled to Stillwater, Oklahoma for one of these games in the mere formality. In a game that the Huskers were expected to win, and the Huskers would not disappoint. In fact, quarterback Keith and McCant would put on a show offensively that many Husker fans would soon not forget. But maybe you did. If so, sit back and enjoy as we take a look back in the archives of Husker video to October 12, 1991. The Huskers and Cowboys at Lewis Field in Stillwater, Oklahoma. You're watching Cornhusker Classics from the archives of Husker Video on O2 TV. Husker, and now back to Cornhusker Classics from the archives of Husker Video on O2 TV. Oklahoma State has won the coin toss. They have deferred their option until the second half of play. Nebraska will receive. They'll defend the West goal as we're about ready to get started here. Stillwater, Oklahoma, Lewis Field. 81 degrees at kickoff. Clear skies, a gorgeous afternoon for football. Myers will kick it off for Oklahoma State. As Nebraska waits the opening kick of the game, the kick is off. High end over end kick. It will be fielded inside the five yard line. Brought out past the 20, the 25, out to the 35 yard line as the Huskers will have great field position to get us started here on this October afternoon. First down and 10 at the 37 yard line. Keith and McCant in at quarterback. Derek Brown is the eye back. McCant off to the left side. He throws it off, finds Turner. Complete for four yards out to the 41 yard line. That bring up second down and six. Huskers in the I formation. McCant hands off to Brown. Back up the middle. Picks up one or two yards. We'll spot him down at the 42 yard line. It'll be third down and five. Nebraska in the I formation. McCant option right side. Tucks it under across the 45 out near the 50 yard line. Picks up seven yards. He needed five. Good for first down yardage. It'll be first down and 10 at the Huskers' own 49-yard line. First drive of the ball game. Here's the handoff back to Derek Brown. He scoots through the middle, gets into Cowboy territory to the 44, make it 45-yard line. He's second down and four as Brown picks up six on the carry. Here's the pitch back to Brown across the 45 down to the 42-yard line. That'll be near first down. It'll be third down and one. Third down and one, McCant keeps it himself, gets a surge from his offensive line back up the middle. Spotted at the 40 yard line, good enough for first down yardage. First down and 10 for the Huskers. McCant on the run, throws off to the right side. He finds Hughes, Tyrone Hughes, good for five yards, half the yardage needed. Second down and five at the 35. Huskers will stay in the eye. Here's the handoff to Brown, right back up left side. Picks up one yard. He's brought down by Garmin. It'll be third down and four for the Huskers at the 34-yard line. McCant, third down, wants to throw, looks across the middle, wide open as Hughes. He gets it at the 10, five touchdown, Huskers. And the Huskers are on the board first on a 34-yard touchdown pass from Keith and McCant to Tyrone Hughes. Byron Bennett comes in for the point after. He puts his right foot into it, and it is good. Nine plays, 63 yards, took four minutes and 14 seconds, and the Huskers are out in front seven to nothing with 10.46 remaining here. And the first quarter of play as Oklahoma State waits for their first chance on offense. Byron Bennett kicks it off for the Huskers. Markham fields it at the goal line, brings it past the 15 out to the 20 yard line. And Oklahoma State will come out on offense trailing by seven. Ford at quarterback for Oklahoma State. Ford keeps it himself, comes back up the middle after faking the handoff. The ball comes loose as he hits the ground. And 
they'll say he is down after picking up two yards. Engelbert on the stop. It'll be second down and eight with the ball spot at the 22-yard line. Oklahoma State will line up in the I formation as well. Here's the handoff to the fullback, Franks. He comes back up the middle, finds a nice hole, picks up nine yards. Out to the Oklahoma State 31-yard line. It's first down and 10 for the Cowboys. Ford barks out the signals, hands off to his eye back, Varian. Spins around, tries to make a move, good for one yard. Out to the 32-yard line, it'll be second down and nine yards to go. Single back set now for Oklahoma State. Ford drops back, he looks downfield deep and overthrows Denson, his wide receiver. Incomplete, it'll be third down and nine. Oklahoma State. Looks around, took some time, they call for timeout. And instead, the delay of game clock has run down. It'll cost them five yards, backs them up, third down and 14, with the ball now at their own 27-yard line. Ford drops back on third down, looks across the middle, complete to Denson, up the sideline, gets pushed out of bounds in Husker territory at the 48-yard line. Good for 25 yards and an Oklahoma State first down as they have the ball inside Husker territory. First down and 10 for OSU, wide out on each side. Ford wants to pitch back. He does. Gives it to Varian. Out to the 45, make it 44 yard line. Good for four yards. Second down and six. Second down and six. They'll run the pitch to the left side this time. Gives it to Denson. He gets back to the original line of scrimmage. No gain on the run as Engelbert stops him. Third down and six now at the Husker 44. Ford rolls out to the right side. He's looking downfield off of the fingertips. Milliner was the intended receiver. Incomplete fourth down and Oklahoma State will have to kick it away. Benson comes in to kick. Takes a low snap. And a high kick as he tries to place it inside. Deep and it goes out of bounds and is down at the five yard line and the Huskers are pinned back deep for their second possession of the ball game. Oklahoma State wearing the all orange for this big, big eight contest. Here's the handoff on first down to Derek Brown. He goes back up the middle, picks up five yards out to the 10 yard line. It's second down and five. Man in motion right to left. Here's the handoff to Brown. Brown left side across the 10 up to the 12 yard line. Picks up two yards before being stopped by Colbert. It's brought down, it's third down and three at the Husker 12-yard line. High formation for the Big Red. Keith and McCant rolls out on the run, throws it. It's complete to Turner. He comes down with it at the 18-yard line. Good enough for a first down. The first down and 10 for Nebraska. Keith and McCant uses the Huskers' first timeout of the first half. Back to action, first down for Nebraska. Man in motion right to left. McCant fakes the reverse and he does give it off to Turner who comes around the right side. And penalty flags come out on the play. It'll be a clipping call against the Huskers and that will back them up to their own 12 yard line. So negate the run by Turner and it's first down and 16 now for the Huskers at their own 12 yard line. McCant drops back, wants to throw, looks downfield. Nobody open, he'll go on the run across the 12, 13, 14 yard line before he is stopped by Nobles of Oklahoma State. Pickup of two on the carry for McCant makes it second down and 14 at the Husker 14 yard line. Number 10 checks the play. Takes a snap and dumps it off to Johnny Mitchell, his tight end, who goes upfield out across the 30 to the 31 yard line. 17 yards on the pass completion to Johnny Mitchell makes it first down and 10 at the 31. McCant hands off to Derek Brown. Brown back up the middle, picks up a tough yard before being brought down at the 32 yard line, makes it second down and nine yards to go. Mohammed in motion, McCant drops back. He wants to throw, looks up the middle, and it's complete to Abdul Muhammad. 
who picks up six or seven yards just short of first down yardage for NU. Third down and two. Hand off to Brown. He has room. And he nearly gets tripped up. Still on his feet across the 20. The 10-5 touchdown. Derek Brown. And the Huskers have scored again on a beautiful run by Derek Brown as he managed to stay on his feet and make it 61 yards to the end zone. Byron Bennett for the point after. The kick is up, and it is good. A eight-play, 95-yard drive for the Huskers gives NU a 14 to nothing advantage with 2.29 remaining here in the first quarter of play. Byron Bennett puts it back into play. Markham awaits for it. He brings it out across the 30, the 35, the 40-yard line before he is tripped up. 35 yards on the return for Markham and Oklahoma State. Good starting field position again with 2.22 remaining. Here in the first quarter, they'll start at their own 41-yard line. Ford hands off to Berrien. He comes across the line of scrimmage, picks up one or two yards to the 43. It'll be second down and eight for OSU. Second down, Ford wants to pass, has time in the pocket, looks downfield for Thompson, and it is incomplete. Nicely defensed by NU. And it'll be third down and eight yards to go. Ford drops back, wants to throw on third down across the middle, and it's incomplete. Looking for Milliner right up the middle. Had to battle the Nebraska defense and the referee. It's incomplete. Fourth down and eight. And Vincent will come in to punt for the Cowboys. Plenty of time for Vincent. He gets the kick off. He'll take a Cowboy bounce and bounces out of bounds at the 25-yard line of Nebraska. 32 yards on the kick, and the Huskers will have it with 122 remaining here in the first quarter of play. Huskers lead 14 to nothing. Keith and McCant hand off to Derek Brown, back up the middle. Picks up seven or eight yards. Irving stops him, makes it second down and two at the NU 33. Lone back is Derek Brown, wide out on each side for the Huskers. Hand off to Brown, and he runs into the pile. No gain on the play. Colbert, first man to get there for Oklahoma State. And it's third down and two. Third down, option right side. McCant still on his feet, now brought down. He loses a couple of yards on the play, and time will run out on the first quarter as the Huskers lead the Cowboys 14 to nothing. Begin the second quarter of play with the Huskers out in front. 14 to nothing. Fourth down for the Huskers. Mike Stiggy will come in to kick for the first time today. He takes a snap and puts it up. It's a high end over end kick as it's fielded inside the 20-yard line and brought out to the 26-yard line. Milliner on the return for Oklahoma State, and they will begin at their own 26-yard line. First down for OSU, trailing by two touchdowns. High formation for Oklahoma State. Ford checks off. He pitches it to his high back Berrien. Comes up the middle. He's met by Bear and dropped to the turf. Second down and 10 for OSU. Oklahoma State stacks up the left side offensively. Ford drops back. He'll option left side. Pitches it back to Berrien. And again, he's met right away. Bear on the stop once again for the Huskers. And again, no gain as Berrien tries to work the ground against this black shirt defense. Third down and 10, ball still at the 26. Ford drops back, plenty of time on third down. Throws across to Denson, it's complete. Seven yards on the completion, not quite enough as he's met by Anderson. Fourth down for Oklahoma State and they will punt for the third time today. Benson comes in to kick. Takes a snap. And it rolls out of bounds, takes a Cowboy roll, rolls out of bounds at the 37-yard line. 30 yards on the kick, and the Huskers get it back with 12.31 remaining in the first half of play, trying to add to a 14 to nothing lead. Keith and McCant brings the troops back out. There's movement and some contact as OSU jumps off sides and gives the Huskers a free five yards. And they'll spot the ball at the 42-yard line, and we'll try it again. First down and five yards to go for the Huskers, I formation. Hand off to Brown. Brown tries the right side. He's met by Williams. After picking up a yard, it'll be second down and four. Hand off up the middle of Derek Brown. He picks up five or six as he gets near midfield. 
will spot the ball at the 49 yard line. Good enough for a first down as the clock continues to run here in the first half. McCant drops back. He wants to throw. He looks for Turner. It's complete. Out to the 40 to the 39 yard line. It'll be first down and 10. 12 yards on the pass from McCant to Turner. And the Huskers are driving once again. Huskers on first down. McCant, option left side, keeps it himself. He's brought down. Gains on the stop for Oklahoma State. Makes it second down and 12 as Keith and McCant loses two yards on the carry. McCant, second down, throws off to Johnny Mitchell. He picks up eight or nine yards as he's ridden out of bounds. Makes it third down and three with the ball at the 32-yard line. Huskers out in front, 14 to nothing. McCann hands off to Brown. Brown crashes through the middle. Picks up a yard. It'll be short of the first down. It'll be fourth down and two. And at the 31-yard line, the Huskers will try to go for it on fourth down. McCann under center. Drops back. He's going to throw on fourth down. Now he's pressured. Flushes out of the pocket. Looks downfield, and it's incomplete. Looking for Hawkins on the near sideline. He wants a flag. He will not get it, and the Huskers have been stopped on downs. And Oklahoma State has stopped Nebraska. Will get the ball back at their own 31-yard line with 9.22 remaining here in the first half of play. Here's the handoff to Sanders, the fullback, as he loses the ball. The Huskers are on top of it. White with the fumble recovery for the Huskers and one play. And Oklahoma State gives the ball back, and the Huskers will take it at the Oklahoma State 30-yard line. High formation, here's the handoff to Lewis, right back up the middle, across the 20 near the 15-yard line. Brought down just short of the 15. They'll spot him at the 16. 14 yards on the carry. Be first down and 10 from the 16-yard line. Keith and McCant drops back, play action, wants to throw, looks for his tight end. Johnny Mitchell, it's complete inside the 10, inside the 5. Brought down at the 3-yard line. 13 yards on the completion from McCant to Mitchell. And the Huskers are in scoring distance once again. First down and goal to go with the ball at the three yard line. Full house backfield, here's the handoff to Brown and he will pick up two yards, be stopped just short of the goal line by a yard. He'll be first down or make that second down and goal to go from one yard out. Here's the handoff to Brown over the pile into the end zone, touchdown Huskers. And Derek Brown scores once again and the Huskers are now out in front, 20 to nothing. Byron Bennett for the point after. It's up and it's good. And the Huskers now lead Oklahoma State 21 to nothing. Byron Bennett to kick it off for the fourth time this afternoon. Markham awaits for it. He takes it at the two yard line, brings it out past the 15, and stopped at the 15. Loses a yard after contact, and they'll spot him at the 14 yard line. And Oklahoma State will try to get on the board. 7.51 remaining in the first half of play. It's been all Huskers, 21 0. I formation. Ford drops back. He wants to throw on first down. Looks for Milliner on the left side. He spins around after catching the ball. Brought down at the 20-yard line. Six yards on the completion. And a flag after the play. Will be a personal foul on the Huskers after the play. That will cost them 15 yards and a first down. And OSU has the ball now. First and 10 at their own 35-yard line. Downfield, the pass was incomplete. Knocked away. And second down and 10. Huskers nearly jumped off sides, but back on side, no flag. Ford hands off to Berrien, tries the left side, finds a little gap. Picks up three yards before being met by Anderson. It's third down and seven at the 38. Ford examines the defense, drops back, wants to throw, looks across the middle, and it's incomplete. Kirksey was the intended receiver, but it falls short. It's fourth down, and OSU will have to kick once again. Vincent comes in to do the honors. Vincent takes a snap, no pressure, gets the kick off. And it will not be fielded. The Huskers will let it bounce. And it bounces out of bounds at the 35-yard line. 27 yards on the kick. 
Huskers have it with 6-11 remaining in the first quarter of play as Mickey Joseph comes in now at quarterback for the Huskers. Joseph looked like he wanted to run option. He drops back. He wants to throw. Looks for Abdul Muhammad, and it's incomplete. Just past the outstretched hands of Muhammad. And it's second down and 10 for NU. Joseph hands off to Jones. Back up the middle. Nothing on the play. Third down and 10 for the Huskers. Calvin Jones in at eye back. Mickey Joseph in at quarterback. The second string offense for the Huskers as Joseph tries to find Abdul Muhammad once again. It's incomplete. Fourth down and 10. Mike Stiggy will come in to kick from his own 20 yard line. Stiggy has a snap. The kick is up. Milliner awaits for it. He fields it as 24 yard line. Brings it across the 30. The ball came loose, but they'll say he was down, and Oklahoma State will keep it and start their own 31 yard line. Cowboys in the eye. Ford still in at quarterback. Ford options the right side, pitches it back to Barrian, who comes across the 35 to the 36 yard line. It'll be second down and five at the 36. Ford drops back to throw on second down. It's complete to Kirksey. Nearly on his knee when he caught it, gets back a couple more yards after the catch. Seven yards on the completion. It'll be a first down at the 43 yard line with 423 remaining. Here in the first half of play. Oklahoma State looking for some points before halftime. Here's the pass downfield. Milliner over his shoulder, and they say he caught it in bounds as he's knocked out of bounds at the 32 yard line. 26 yards on the pass completion from Ford to Milliner. It'll be first down and 10 at the Husker 31 as Oklahoma State gets into Husker territory. off Barion near side to the 20 inside the 20 down to the 17 yard line 14 yards before being met by Tyrone Bird makes it first down and 10 at the 17 one back set now for Oklahoma State Ford hands off to Denson goes straight back up the middle Picks up one or two. Second down and eight. 15 yard line. Ford tucks it under and he is stopped by a trio of Huskers led by Trev Alberts. As he is brought down. Loses a yard on the sequence as third down and nine. Ford on third down inside the red zone. Looks down field for Thompson and it's incomplete. Nice coverage by the Huskers secondary. It'll be fourth down and nine. And Oklahoma State will try to kick their way onto the scoreboard as Myers comes in to try a 33-yard field goal attempt. The kick is up, and it is good. Eight plays, 53 yards, took three minutes and 24 seconds. And Oklahoma State gets on the scoreboard before halftime, but still trails by 18. Myers puts it into play. It's taken at the nine-yard line by Hughes. Out across the 20, out to the 25, near the 30-yard line. It's driven out of bounds. 1.44 remaining in the first half. The Huskers with two timeouts. And the ball at their own 29. High formation for the Big Red. McCant drops back. He wants to throw on first down. Tries to set up the screen. Gives it off to Hughes. Picks up 10 or 11 yards. That's good for first down yardage out to the 40-yard line. First down for the Huskers at the 40. McCant, wide open on the right side, finds Hughes once again. Another 14 yards into Oklahoma State territory at the 46-yard line of OSU. First down, McCant wants to go through the air again. Looks for John Bostic. It's complete down inside the 25-yard line. Good for 23 yards. McCant to Bostic. And another first down, first down and 23 yards as McCant has gone through the air on three straight plays. McCann hands off to Derek Brown. Brown picks up a yard. Nobles wraps him up. It'll be second down and nine at the 22. 
Man in motion left to right. McCant drops back. Looks to throw and it's intercepted. Intercepted by Oklahoma State. Thompson got a hand up there and brought it down and puts an end to the Husker scoring threat with under a minute to go here in the first half. Huskers were driving as McCant was leading them through the air but throws the interception and Oklahoma State will take over on their own 24 yard line. Here's the handoff to Franks who's checked into the game. Picks up four or five up the middle and it's second down and five at the 29 yard line. Single back set, Ford drops back, wants to throw. Looks across the middle off the hands of Franks. We can't bring it down and it's incomplete. It'll be third down and five. Ford pitches it back to Denson and the Huskers are on top of it. John Perella on the stop as they lose yardage on the last play of the first half of the Huskers go to the locker room leading 21 to 3. You're watching Corn Husker Classics from the archives of Husker Video on O2 TV. Special teams down there quickly. And they'll stop them. Poor field position for the Pokes as they'll start on their own 14. First down for Oklahoma State. Their first possession of the second half. Ford pitches it back to Berrien and he picks up a yard out to the 15 yard line. Carmer on the stop for the Huskers and it's second down and nine at the 15 yard line. Ford rolls around to the right side. Looks downfield and the pass is completed to Cheatwood. Picks up 18 yards on the play. And it's good for a first down, first down and 10 at the 33 yard line. High formation for Oklahoma State. Ford drops back, wants to pass, looks to the sideline, it's incomplete, thrown out of bounds. It'll be second down and 10 at the 33. Single back formation for OSU. They throw up the middle and it's knocked away, incomplete. Great coverage by the Huskers. It's third down and 10. Oklahoma State trailing by 18, wants to go through the air again. They find Thompson, the pass is complete, but drops short of the first down as he picks up six yards. Petko on the stop for the Big Red, makes it fourth down and four at the 39 yard line. Benson comes in to kick for Oklahoma State. And time has run out on the play clock. It'll be a delay a game on Oklahoma State. It'll give them an extra five yards to work with. As Benson backs up inside his own 20 now to kick. High snap brought down. Kick waited for. Turner takes it at his own 29. Runs laterally as he gets across a 30. Out to the 33. Four yards on the return after a 37-yard punt. And 12.43 remaining in the third quarter. And the Huskers have it at their own 33-yard line. First down for the Huskers. Keith and McCant, spectacular in the first half through the air. McCant looks around, finds Turner. Turner across the 40-yard line, picks up eight yards. It's second down and two at the Nebraska 41. McCant hands off to Brown. Brown looks for the first down marker, picks up an extra yard as well. Three yards on the carry, makes it first down and 10 at the 44-yard line. McCamp wants to go through the air on first down. He finds his receiver, Hughes, who picks up another dozen yards into Oklahoma State territory. Be another first down at Oklahoma State's 43-yard line. The Huskers are on the move. McCamp under center. Hand off to Calvin Jones. Jones back up the middle across the 40. Down to the 36-yard line. Seven yards on the carry makes it second down and three. McCant, option. Now he tucks it under. Across the 30 to the 20. The 15 makes a move across the 10. Brought down at the 8-yard line. 28 yards on the scramble by Keith and McCant. It's first down and goal to go at the 8-yard line. McCant, lone setback is Calvin Jones. McCant fakes the handoff. Finds Johnny Mitchell, and it's a touchdown. Nebraska Mitchell falling. Comes down with the ball into the end zone. 8-yard touchdown pass from Keith and McCant to Johnny Mitchell. Byron Bennett comes in for the point after. 
Bennett for the PAT. The kick is up. Bandit is good. And the Huskers have taken a commanding 28-3 lead with 10-20 remaining here in the third quarter of play. Byron Bennett puts his right foot into it. Taken at the goal line by Denson. He comes out across the 20, out to the 25, to the 27-yard line. 27 yards on the return for Denson. And Oklahoma State will start 10-14 remaining here in the third quarter. First down at their own 27. Ford under center. Hands off to Berrien. Up the middle. Out to the 35-yard line. Make it the 36. Picks up nine yards. Makes it second down and one. High formation for OSU. Ford keeps it himself, tries to find the gap and the first down. He does both as they measure it. It's just enough. It'll be first down and 10 at the 37-yard line for Oklahoma State. Ford puts in the air, finds Kirksey. Kirksey is able to bring it in. Picks up five or six out to the 43-yard line. Second down and four for OSU. Oklahoma State hands off, flags come, and whistles blow. It'll be a legal procedure against Oklahoma State that will cost them five yards, backs them up to their own 38. Second down and nine for Oklahoma State. Ford drops back inside his own pocket, has some time, his receiver gets knocked down, and the pass falls incomplete. Third down and nine for Oklahoma State. Ford drops back, he wants to throw on third down, looks up the middle to Kirksey and it's complete. 13 yards on the reception out into Husker territory at the 49 yard line. It'd be first down and 10 for OSU. Ford, right side this time, goes to the air again, finds Milliner. Five yards on the completion. As Oklahoma State going to the air game now, trailing 28 to three. Ford gets flushed out across the right side. One yard on the carry makes it third down and four for OSU. One back set, Ford drops back, wants to throw, looks up the right sideline and it's incomplete. Markham, the intended receiver for Oklahoma State, comes up a little limpy and a penalty flag will be holding against Oklahoma State. The Huskers will decline that. It makes it fourth down and Oklahoma State will have to kick. Benson comes in to punt, takes a snap and puts his leg into it. And the ball takes a bounce and Oklahoma State falls down onto it and keeps it out of the end zone and it's down at the one yard line. Beautiful punt by Vincent. A 42 yard kick and the Huskers are deep, pinned deep at their one yard line. Keith and McCant under center. McCant hands off to Calvin Jones. Back across the line of scrimmage, then driven back into the end zone. He'll mark his forward progress at the one yard line. Cannon there first for Oklahoma State. McCant wants to throw in his own end zone. He has some pressure and he's sacked in the end zone. And that will be a safety. Keith and McCant could not get free. He's brought down and the Oklahoma State Cowboys have added two more points to the scoreboard to make it 28 to five. So the Huskers can't get out after being pinned at the one yard line after the kick and the free kick by Mike Stiggy from his own 20 is fielded at the 30 yard line by Harmon across the 40 out to the 45 yard line. Makes it first down and 10 as Oklahoma State starts this possession. Great field position, thanks to the safety and free kick. Ford hands off to Franks, he goes right back up the gut. Nothing on the play, no gain, second down and 10. Cowboys now trailing 28 to five. Ford puts it up in the air, looks for Kirksey, it's complete inside the 30 down to the 20 yard line where he's brought down by Carmer. 36 yards on the pass from Ford to Kirksey. Makes it first down and 10 at the Husker 20. I 
formation. Ford keeps it, runs back, tries to pitch it at the last second. It goes out of bounds. And they'll mark it at the 20-yard line. No gain on the play. For second down and 10. Ford rolls out, looks downfield towards the end zone, and it's tipped away. Milliner, the intended receiver, makes it third down and 10 now for Oklahoma State as they look for their first touchdown of the day, trailing 28 to 5. Ford assesses the situation, some confusion. Oklahoma State calls timeout, third down and 10. The right personnel now on the field for OSU. Ford drops back on third down, wants to throw, looks into the end zone, and it's incomplete. Kirksey, the intended receiver, as he goes crashing into that wall near the end zone. And Oklahoma State will try for a field goal. Myers comes in for the 37-yard kick. The kick is up, and it is good. 442 remaining in the third quarter, and Oklahoma State has cut the lead to 20, 28 to 8. Myers kicks it off back to the Huskers, who has given up five straight points to Oklahoma State now. It's fielded by Hughes at the three, brought out across the 15, and he is stopped at the 19-yard line. The Huskers will go to work. 4.35 remaining here in the third quarter. Stacked backfield. McCann hands off to Lewis. Up the middle, picks up a yard, and it'll be second down and nine at the 20-yard line. McCann. Rolls out. Thinks about throwing. Now tucks it under across the 20. The 25 makes a move back to the center of the field. He's brought down at the 27 yard line. Picks up seven. It's third down and two. McCann, option left side. He's stacked up. Loses a yard on the play. Satter White there first for Oklahoma State. The ball came loose, but they're going to mark him down. It's fourth down and three at the 26. Mike Stiggy will come in to kick once again for NU. Stiggy waits near his 10-yard line. Pressure from Oklahoma State. He gets ran into. And no flag on the play. As Harmon fair catches it at the 37-yard line. 37 yards on the kick. No return. 2.33 remaining here in the third quarter. Huskers trying to add to a 28-8 lead. Oklahoma State trying to score once again. Here's the pitch back to Barian. Across the 35 out to the 40. He's driven down at the 41. Picks up four yards, second down and six. Ford drops back on second down. Plenty of time. Looks across the middle, and it's complete. Milliner double teamed. Comes up with the ball across the 50. Some words exchanged out on the field. It's first down and 10 at the 47. Ford under center, keeps it himself down to the 44-yard line. Picks up three yards on the carry. It's second down and seven at the 44 of Nebraska. Ford drops back, wants to throw, looks to the near sideline, and it's incomplete, out of bounds, overthrown. No chance for Cheatwood, who's on the near side, to come up with that. Be third down and seven. Ford drops back, third down, looks downfield, and it's intercepted. Bird comes up with it, across the 30, still on his feet up to the 34-yard line, where he is brought down, 14 yards on the return by Bird, and the Huskers have it back with 29 seconds to go here in the third quarter. Keith and McCann on first down, flushes out, and it's complete to John Bostick. Across the 50 down to the 49-yard line as McCann has had a heck of a day through the air thus far. First down for the Huskers at the 49. McCann under center. Options the right side, keeps it himself across the 45 down to the 40-yard line as Keith and McCann picks up nine yards, and that brings us to the end of the third quarter with the Huskers leading 28-8. 
You're watching Husker Classics from the archives of Husker Video on O2 TV. Welcome back as we begin the fourth quarter of play with the Huskers leading 28 to 8. Here's the handoff to Derek Brown. He has a hole across the 20, across the 10, 5, touchdown Huskers as Derek Brown on the first play of the fourth quarter goes 40 yards into the end zone for the touchdown. Byron Bennett for the PAT. Snap kick is up and it is good. 14.52 remain in the game and the Huskers out in front 35 to 8. Mike Stiggy will kick off for the Huskers as he boots this one deep. The ball will roll into the end zone and be taken for a touchback. Cowboys trailing by 27. Ford hands off to Barrion on the first play. They'll keep it on the ground across the 20. That's to the 22 yard line. Two yards on the carry for Barrion. Makes it second down and eight for OSU. Option to the left side. They pitch back to Barrion. Tries to find room. Tries to get back to the line of scrimmage and he's driven down by Leggett. No gain on the play. Makes it third down. Oklahoma State calls timeout, third down and eight for OSU. Ford draws back, he's pressured, looks for Berrien, and it's over his hands and incomplete. It's fourth down, and Oklahoma State will have to kick it back to the Big Red. Vincent comes out to kick inside his own 10. Huskers back off the kick and will play the return. Hughes fields it at the 44, out to the 50. Six yards on the return after a 34-yard kick. And the Huskers have it, 13-39 remaining. Here in the game, leading 35-8. to eight. Single back set, they hand off to Calvin Jones across the 45 to 40, down to the 35. He's taken out of bounds at the 31 yard line by Irving. And it's first down and 10 for the Huskers at the OSU 31 yard line. Keith and McCant wide out on each side. Drops back, he wants to throw. He has Abdul Muhammad complete. Five yard line, stays on his feet, gets into the end zone, touchdown NU. And the Huskers drive 50 yards in two plays and score on a 31-yard touchdown completion from Keith and McCant to Abdul Muhammad. Point after is up and it is good. And the Huskers lead 42 the eight. 13-26 remaining in the ball game as the Huskers are putting this one away. Byron Bennett comes in to kick off. Denson fields it at the eight, across the 20, out near the 25-yard line. And that's where Oklahoma State will begin. 42 to eight, the Huskers out in front by 34. Ford under center, drops back, looks to throw downfield, looks for Milliner, nowhere in the neighborhood. And it's incomplete, it'll be second down and 10 yards to go. Ford examines the defense, takes a snap, drops back, wants to throw on second down, looks, and it's intercepted, intercepted by Beeler, and he has some room across the 20, driven out of bounds and, and thrown into the wall by Oklahoma State, and he's upset as he goes after, and now a penalty flag will come in. No flag was thrown, and the officials will talk about this, and Beeler is hot. He was thrown after the play. Couldn't tell, the officials said it was not a late hit. And flags come out afterwards. We will have offsetting penalties, unsportsmanlike conduct. It'll be for the actions after the play though, and not the late hit. Either way, first down for the Huskers at the 11 yard line. Mickey Joseph in now at quarterback. Keeps it himself on the option keeper and into the end zone. Touchdown Huskers as Mickey Joseph 
One play drive, 11 yard touchdown, and the Huskers are piling it on now as Byron Bennett comes in for the PAT. Kick is up, and it is good. One play, 11 yards, six second scoring drive for the Huskers, and the Huskers are out in front 49 to eight with 13.01 remaining here in the ball game. Byron Bennett to kick it off for the Big Red. High kick is into the end zone. It will be a touchback. And Oklahoma State will start at their own 20 with 13.01 remaining here in the ball game, trailing by 41. Ford under center, first down. Two wideouts on the left side. He'll pitch it back to Berrien, across the 20, out to the 23-yard line. He's met by Branch. The ball comes loose, but they'll say it was down. That'll be second down and seven with the ball at the 23. By formation for Oklahoma State. Whistles blow as the ball snapped. It looked like Oklahoma State ran out of time, and they did. It'll be a delay of game. They'll back them up five yards to the 18 yard line. Replay second down, second down and 12. Ford wants to throw, looks for Kirksey. It's complete at the 20 to the 25, out near a first down. Picks up 12 yards on the play. They'll give him the first down at the 30-yard line. First down and 10 for OSU. So Oklahoma State will operate out of the eye, trailing by 41. Ford wants to throw, looks right side. The pass is thrown out of bounds, incomplete. Be second down and 10. Ford drops back, wants to throw, a little bit of pressure, gets away from it, buys some time, and... It's incomplete, a penalty flag will come in, and we're gonna have pass interference on the Huskers as Milliner was hit from behind before that ball arrived. It'll be an automatic first down. The spot of the foul cost him six yards, first down and 10 at the 36. Oklahoma State in the eye. Will go to the air again. Looks for Milliner downfield. It's complete in the Husker territory. As he's knocked out of bounds at the 45-yard line. Good for 19 yards. Reese on the stop for Nebraska. First down and 10 with the ball at the 45. Ford checks off. Hands off. Back up the middle as Berrien picks up two or three yards. He's second down and seven at the 42. Ford drops back, wants to throw on the right side. It's complete to Cheatwood. He picks up a handful of yards. It'll be third down and two at the 37. Ford on the keep. Back to the line of scrimmage, picks up a yard. He'll be a little short. It'll be fourth down and one. And Oklahoma State will go for it on fourth down. Full house backfield. Hands off to the eye. Back and Barian goes up through the middle. Appears to have the first down, and he does. Clock continues to run here in the fourth quarter. Oklahoma State taking their time up to the line. And the whistles will blow, and we're going to have another delay a game on Oklahoma State. That will back them up five yards. Make it first down and 15 at the 39-yard line. Ford options. Off to Berrien, Berrien picks up three or four yards. To the 35, it's second down and 11. Ford wants to throw, he's flushed out of the pocket, he has pressure, he gets it off, he looks down in the end zone, and it's out of bounds, incomplete. Intended for Kirksey, no good. It's third down and 11. Oklahoma State, they'll put it in the air again, looks for Kirksey and it's a little out of his reach, it's incomplete. Be fourth down and 11. And Oklahoma State trailing by 41 will go for it on fourth down. Ford looks, throws, incomplete. And the Huskers have stopped Oklahoma State. 
with 740 remaining here in the ball game. Leading 49 to eight. Huskers trying to add to their lead. Mickey Joseph will stay in at quarterback now, replacing Keith and McCann, who had a career day. Hands off to Calvin Jones. He loses the football, and it's up for grabs. Nearly back on it. Fight for the loose ball. And Oklahoma State has recovered. Calvin Jones had problems finding the handle. Coughs it up. And Oklahoma State takes over at their own 47-yard line with a fresh set of downs. Ford pitches it to Denson in the backfield, across the 50 into Husker territory to the 45-yard line. He's brought down by Reese, and it's second down and two at the 45. Out of the eye, here's the handoff to the fullback, Franks. He goes right back up the middle, picks up a yard. He'll be just short of the first down. It'll be third down and one at the 42-yard line. Handoff, Denson, four or five yards. He's met by Troy Dumas. He's brought down at the 40-yard line. First down for Oklahoma State. Clock running here midway through the fourth quarter. Ford drops back on first down. He wants to throw, looks up the left sideline, and it is incomplete. Incomplete makes it second down. Ford rolls out, looks downfield, tries that sideline once again, and it's incomplete intended for McCone. And a flag comes out, and we may have pass interference on the Huskers once again as a pair of penalty flags come out, and it will be interference on the Big Red. It'll give Oklahoma State a free 15 yards and an automatic first down as the ball now at the 24-yard line. First down and 10 for OSU. Ford will go to the air. Plenty of time. Finds Denson right up the middle. Picks up five yards to the 20, like a 19 yard line as he's brought down. Second down and five for Oklahoma State. Ford hands off. Denson up the middle. Picks up a handful of yards. It'll be first down and 10. So he just gets past that first down marker. Pitch to Denson, finds a hole at the five. Touchdown, Oklahoma State. And Oklahoma State scores their first touchdown of the game here late in the fourth quarter of play. Myers comes in for the point after, and the kick is up, and it is good. Huskers lead 49-15. We'll be back right after this. Myers kicks it off. It'll be taken by Hughes at the four, brought out across the 10, out near the 20. He's looking for some room. He's brought down to the turf. 16-yard return out to the 20-yard line. The Huskers will start there with the big lead and 4-11 left in this ball game. Tom Haas now in at quarterback for the Huskers. Haas fakes the handoff to Jones, tries the end around from Hawkins, looks for room up the left side. Out to the 15, loses yardage on the play. It'll be second down and 13 after a loss of three yards. Haas under center. Haas drops back, he wants to throw. Looking for Abdul Muhammad off of his arm and out of bounds. It'll be third down and 13. Haas barks out the signals. Drops back. He wants to throw on third down up the left sideline, and it's incomplete. Looking for Pleasant up the sideline, and it is past his outstretched arms. And Mike Stiggy will come in to kick from inside his own 10 yard line. Stiggy, no pressure, gets the kick off. And Milliner fields it at zone 25, past the 30 out to the 33 yard line, and Oklahoma State will start there. First down for OSU.
Ford under center. Fakes the handoff, looks for Denson, it's incomplete. That'll bring up second down and 10. Ford drops back, wants to throw again. He has pressure, he's brought down. Hillman gets in there for the Huskers with the quarterback sack. Eight yard loss for Oklahoma State, makes it third down and 18. High formation for OSU. Ford on the run, looks downfield, airs it out. Kirksey's down there, he is covered and makes the catch. Troy Dumas on the coverage, 35 yard reception. It's first down and 10 for OSU at the Husker 40. Ford wants to throw again. He looks downfield, it's incomplete. Penalty flag on the play. We're gonna have a holding penalty against Oklahoma State. That will back him up 18 yards, spot foul. It's first down and 28. Oklahoma State now back at their own 42 yard line. Ford wants to throw, it's complete to Milliner. Picks up 11 of those yards back. Into Husker territory at the 47, it's second down and 17. High formation. Ford wants to throw again downfield, and it's intercepted by the Huskers. Powell comes up with it, and the Huskers force a turnover with 103 remaining here in the ball game. Mickey Joseph back in at quarterback for the Huskers. Joseph options left side, keeps it himself out to the nine yard line, picks up two yards. Garmin on the stop. It'll be second down and eight. Joseph under center. Hands off to Georgia Chola into the game. Picks up five or six yards and that will bring us to the end of this contest and the Huskers are victorious, 49 to 15. You're watching. And now back to Cornhusker Classics from the archives of Husker Video on O2 TV. Keith and McCann's performance was indeed impressive, especially through the air. Very uncharacteristic for a Husker QB. On this day, McCann completed 17 of 19 passes for 231 yards and rushed for additional 55 yards as well. Throw in another 100 plus yard day on the ground for I back Derek Brown, and you get another Big 8 victory from the Nebraska Cornhuskers. Until next time, I'm Todd Walkenhorst. Good night, everybody.